kok berhentinya di situ deketin deh Oh, this car is very, oh, very touchy. Yeah. Yeah, don't worry about that. Everybody says the same thing. <laughs> so don't let it worry you. Hai, hai, hai. Halo semuanya. Um, hari ini aku mau pergi bukan pergi sih nanti aku akan dijemput oleh seseorang <laughs> jadi ceritanya aku ini sebelum kena kanker aku sudah um, bikin sim bukan bikin sim sih di sini itu peraturannya kalau ingin uh, mengendarai mobil harus ada tiga tahap empat sebetulnya sih jadi yang pertama aku harus lulus tes lulus tesnya itu um, kayak di sekolah gitu ngisi ada sekitar 80 soal mengenai rambu-rambu lalu lintas ya habis itu kalau lulus aku dapat um, plat L L itu artinya learner alias belajar tapi kalau orang-orang sini suka nyebutnya lunatic L itu lunatic alias gila soalnya Ya, karena baru belajar jadi masih pada gila. <laughs> masih ya pada gila nggak ngerti peraturan. Nah, habis itu dari L nanti maju lagi ke plat P. P yang hijau atau merah ya? P-nya ada dua deh. P1 dan P2. Dan aku sekarang masih di plat yang L. Jadi aku sebelum um, kena kanker itu aku sudah belajar mobil otomatis sih sama si Matt dan Mama Shelly terus sempat juga nganterin Mama Jenis jadi sedikit banyak aku tahu cara mengemudi nah aku pikir dulu kan di aku dikasih buku untuk ngisi um, jadi jam berapa sampai jam berapa jam berapa mulai nyupir hingga jam berapa selesai nah itu di bukunya ada tulisan aku tuh harus 100 harus mencapai 120 jam nyupir nah jadi itu aku sekarang kalau nggak salah baru 40 jam kalau nggak salah ya 40 jam atau 50 jam gitu deh habis itu aku kena kanker jadi kan nggak bisa nyupir terus aku pikir ah udah deh aku udah nyerah deh lagian udah nyerah nyupir udah terlalu lama terus begitu dikasih tahu sama temenku dia ny dia um, nyoba tes untuk dapetin plat yang P itu cuma sebentar jadi dia nekat sistemnya dia cuman nyupir mobil beberapa jam dengan suaminya lalu dia ikut uh, apa khusus khusus mengemudi habis itu dia tes uh, untuk dapat yang plat P lah aku kan bingung kok cepet ternyata kalau um, umurnya di atas 25 tahun itu nggak perlu uh, menyelesaikan 120 jam mengendarai lah tiwasan Aku selama ini sampai nulis-nulis uh, di dalam bukunya berapa jam, dari jam berapa sampai jam berapa, total berapa jam. Ah. Nah, makanya hari ini aku udah janjian dengan instruktur, karena aku nggak punya mobil, mobilku udah dijual karena waktu itu aku sudah menyerah untuk menyupir. Jadi, uh, minggu lalu aku sudah telepon dengan instruktur mobil uh, kursus mengkursus mengemudi di daerah kasino um, jadi mereka punya paket kalau yang nggak punya mobil atau nggak dia nganterin ke kantor mereka mereka akan jemput ke rumahku memang sedikit mahal harganya jadi 
total per paket per paket untuk 5 jam itu 350 dolar alias 3.500.000 untuk 5 jam ya jadi hari ini aku akan dijemput ke rumah habis itu keliling-keliling mengendarai selama satu jam lalu aku akan di drop lagi ke depan rumah ya sudah lama aku nggak nyupir sih nggak tahu udah lupa atau masih bisa ya jadi kita lihat saja Mobil penjemput sudah tiba. Eh, hey, burung makan apa kau? Kok berhentinya di situ? Deketin deh. Fill in the logbook. Because they gave me the New South Wales, what is that? The service? Yes, service they, New South Wales. They yeah. gave me the book. So yeah. I thought, oh, I need to fill the book. So That's why I kept on filling the book and then my friend said, you don't have to. No, that's right. Yeah. yeah. You are um, about 25 years old, no need. Oh, that's I was it. like, ah, oh, jeez. Now, I'm not sure on the streets of Korokai, so you might have to be my tour guide for the day. <laughs> so we'll go for a bit of a drive. So windscreen wipers, blinkers are over there. Yep. Up and down. Okay, that's it. Foot on brake, into drive, or D. That's it. Oh, you get that out of your road. And handbrake off. Oh yeah, I forgot this. Yeah, you'll be right with that. Now before we take off, uh, this. Yep, yeah, mm -hmm. that's it. Before you leave the curb, this is for the purpose of the test. Okay. We're leaving the curb. Mm -hmm. We're going to come out onto traffic. So your blinker has to be on for five seconds. So that's the first thing you do. Put your blinker on, put right. it into drive, yep. handbrake off, foot on brake, mm -hmm. and then you start with your head checks. So it's over your left shoulder, mm -hmm. mirror, 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 over your right shoulder, and then if no car's coming, off we go. Oh, okay. But that's all right. I'm going to tell you all the way through what you got to do. So don't worry if you don't remember it all. Oh well. Oops. Oh, this car is very, oh, very touchy. Yeah. Yeah. Don't worry about that. Everybody says the same thing. <laughs> so don't let it worry you. Unlike my uh, previous car, I need to hit it hard. No, this one's very responsive. Okay, so when we're coming up to an intersection such as this, we're going to go straight ahead. Okay. So we crawl forward to the line. Mm -hmm. Very touchy this car. Yeah. And we stop. We give way to all the traffic. Yeah. We wait for a nice gap. Nothing coming. Across we go. Beautiful. Do you think you'll go with a reverse parallel park? Ah, uh, that too. Yep, right go. Okay. We just need to find a space where it's got a nice big gap. What I'm going to get you to do is just go straight ahead. Oh, but there is no road. No, 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 it's that's alright. I'm oh. going to get you to turn around. Oh, okay. So check both ways. Okay. Now what I want you to do is just ease it over onto the grass. Yep, about there. Not too far down. 
right hand blinker okay now every time you put a blinker on you've got to do head checks so when your left blinker goes on it's an automatic mirror mirror check over your shoulder so every time i blink that means blink, you've, you've got to do head checks oh, okay but oh. if your left blinker's on mm -hmm. you've only got to check on the left hand side because that's the way you're turning if your right hand blinker is on mm -hmm. mirror mirror check over your shoulder because that's the way you're turning okay. all righty so i'm going to get you to do a three-point turn because you'll probably get one of those in the test so we are technically leaving the curb mm. so like i said earlier this is the exception to the rule you've got to do your five head checks so mm -hmm. do those and then we are going to mm -hmm. put the steering wheel on full lock as we move forward really slowly that's it keep going around because we're going to turn the car around that's it nice and slow and stop there beautiful now we're going to turn the wheel back the other way reverse. all the way around yep into reverse all the way back around yep do your checks beautiful and we're going to stop there yep that's it and now all the way around that way round you go perfect well done have you done one of those before um i think so now what i want you to do is slow it right down because we're going to pull up beside this ute here oh yeah that's all right actually um all righty oh. let's go up a little bit further not parking yeah, we will, just oh. not here. Oh. So go up a little bit further. Okay. Now see this green car here? Yeah. We're going to pull up right beside it, about a metre out from it. So out that way. Wait, there's a car behind you. Okay. That's all right. That's all right. I'll let the car pass first. That's all right. Okay. So you might have to put it into reverse. Go backwards. Okay, that's it. So about a meter out and pull right up beside it. further forward okay a little bit further forward oh. you're okay don't worry about other cars yep okay so stop about there left hand blinker on now I'm gonna guide you through this one okay so wheel on full lock and we're gonna start to move backwards very slowly nice and slow that's it. That's it. Nice and slow. Keep going. Okay. Now very slowly. Turn the wheel. Very slowly. That's it. Turn it a little bit more. need to go in just a little bit closer or park a little bit oh, closer yeah. to the gutter so mm -hmm. yep turn the wheel a couple of times better put it into drive into D oh because <laughs> we're gonna go forward <laughs> that's it that's it and then forward a little bit more okay stop about there and oh, still a bit too far. That's all. I'll have a look in a minute. So you put it into into park. Handbrake on. 
Now, it, that is, if you were like that much closer, absolutely perfect. Long, absolutely perfect. Reverse parallel park, what you've just done, is probably the hardest park of all of them to do. And you've nearly done it perfect on your first go. So, well done. Are we finished? We are finished. Okay, back to my house. Check over your shoulder as you go around. Aha, uh -huh, here's you just here. Yeah. Is hubby at home or he's no. out of work? He's working. Beautiful. Yeah, just stop there. That'll be excellent. <laughs> Beautiful. Eh, lihatlah. Baru selesai belajar mobil. Eh, di rumah ada ini.